uni, I had an option of choosing one module called independent study. And within that, we were given the choice to do anything we wanted. And for the longest time, I wanted to do a documentary. So I went to see my module leader and I said, I want to pitch my idea for a documentary. And my documentary was on how Star Trek changed the world. And honestly, if you Google it, it's somewhere out there, but don't, it's awful how I edited it. However, what this series taught me is if I had the knowledge back then, I would have done so much better. And actually, I think I'm gonna adjust the uh, documentary again. So this week, I'm going to break down this camera move in After Effects. Essentially, you have your image or your map, your graph, your animation on one sort of area, like a studio space. And then you have your 3D space camera. And what we do, or Vox will do, is move the camera, which is the window that you'll see in After Effects, over the object they want. And then depending on what size, what time, or what scale, they'll move in or out to show so much of it, and then move straight on to the next thing, how fast or how slowly they want. And this is something we're going to animate in After Effects. In After Effects, create a new comp. 1920 by 1080p, 25 frames per second, as always, and hit OK. Next thing I'm going to do is drag and drop my image. Now I'm going to use the Daily Profit from Harry Potter. I'm going to increase the scale just to fit it better for now. Using the previous tutorial, I've built in some stroke effect and I'm animating certain letters and words to come in at a certain point. And then from the previous tutorials, with the stroke effect, I have Dumbledore animating on. Shortly after, I have this D, which should be vanished, but it does vanish and then come back on. Don't worry too much about that. I'm going to pre-comp these, right click and pre-comp, and hit OK. Now to make this effect work, we need to put this into 3D space. So to do that, first thing we do is right click, new and camera. I'm going to choose a default 35 millimeters and hit OK. From there, we need to place this newspaper into 3D space by, by clicking here. And now I can finally increase the scale so it covers the whole of the composition. But first thing I'm going to do is change the position and move it down. I want the camera to pan in and pan across the word Dumbledore as it starts and then zoom out. To do that, I'm going to move the position of the camera into this D here. So first, move in. And to do that, I'm going to change my view from one view to four view to give you different versions of the camera and the object in 3D space. And this is how the end scene will look. So this is my active camera. So I'm going to move the camera right above the word D here. And I'm going to click on the keyframe here and move along to roughly about two seconds or maybe three. And then move across. To give this more life, I'm going to make it an angle slightly as if you were reading it across the page and at the same time by five seconds, I want it to zoom out to show the whole page again. So it says Dumbledore, daft or dangerous. Perfect. And then you get the title Daily Profit. I'm going to move this keyframe out a bit. Now that you know the key, this is such a simple effect. You can add to this and pan down the newspaper to reveal a different letter for D. If I had more time, I would go back and put in Dumbledore's animated video. But essentially, that's how Vox have done it, and that's how Harry Potter did it. See, it's pretty simple once you know how. It's just a few little tricks and animation. And you're done. I'd just like to end with, I hope you enjoy this Vox series. I hope you do more series in the future. And I just want to show how easy it is to elevate your videos if you just know these little hacks. So let me know what you think in the comments below. Smash like if you got this far. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already and ding that notification bell.
as it'll let you know when my videos come which is every week as always wow i've just realized i've asked for a lot there so please just do one of them but as always stay inspired